do not bring your iPhone, iPad, any device to church to read your Bible from it. Do you understand? You can do that in your office. You can do that when you are anywhere. But to read your Bible, the Bible from the phone, when you are in church, it doesn't show reference to God. It doesn't show reference. John 5.39 says, search the scripture. It didn't say punch the scripture. It says, search the scripture, not punch the scripture. Joshua 1.8 said, this book of the law, not this tablet of the law, not this phone of the law, this book of the law. I know you are going to say, maybe there were no God, there were no technologies in that time. God sees the end from the beginning. He knew there would be technologies before he said this book of the law. Luke chapter 4 verse 17 says he opened the book. Verse 20 says he closed the book. Hebrews chapter 10 verse 7 said, I come in the volume of the book. Bank, you turn off your phone. So don't bring that and you are reading your Bible from your phone. It's not a sin, but it's an error. There's a difference between sin and there's a difference between error. Matthew 22, 29, Jesus said to them, Ye do err, not knowing the scripture, nor the power of God. Some people don't live in sin, but they live in error. Ye do err, not knowing the scriptures or the power of God. Error. 1 John 4, 6 said, This is the spirit of error. Error. We know the spirit of truth and the spirit of error. There's error. Ecclesiastes 5, verse 6 says, Don't say before the angel it was an error. Ecclesiastes 10 5 says there's an error I see under the sun. Error. Second Peter 2 18 says we have escaped them that live in error. Alright? Second Peter 3 17, the Bible was speaking, it said that they that live in error, they are led away by the wicked. So let's understand, place respect and value. Do not use your phone in the church. Don't open it to read the Bible. Bring the book, not the phone. Is that understood? Don't say everybody has been doing it. So what, what about others? Everybody can be wrong. That a lie has been in office for a long time doesn't make it the truth. Longevity is not legality. Is that true? You know, there are people who already have it. You know, the problem with Nigerians is that for you to, once they hold a position, for you to convince them, they will devise arguments. But he that is wise will listen. Jesus said, he that has ear, because not everybody brought ear to church. Some left it at home. But those that brought their ear to church, let them hear.